welcome back to our channel. In this video, we'll guide you through the process of enabling SharePoint online integration with Dynamics 365. Before we begin, please ensure you meet the following prerequisites. Make sure you have a Dynamics 365 online subscription and also you'll need a SharePoint online plan, which is available with Microsoft 365 or Office 365 plans, for example, E3. First thing that we will need to do is to check our permissions. To enable SharePoint integration, you should be a Dynamics 365 admin and SharePoint admin. Being a global administrator is even better. Let's take a look at an example of how documents are currently missing in related records under entities like accounts, contacts, or cases. To get started with the setup, access Power Platform Admin Center. Open your web browser and go to Power Platform Admin Center at https admin.powerplatform.microsoft.com slash environments. Navigate to the environment which you want to enable SharePoint Online integration. Go to the settings of the organization. Now let's enable document management settings. Under the integration section, find document management settings. Click on it to access the document management settings in Dynamics 365 CRM. Here you will see the option to select enable server based SharePoint integration. Click next to proceed. Now let's configure SharePoint integration. In the following dialog, choose whether you want to enable SharePoint integration for online or on-premise deployment. For this example, we'll select online. Next, you'll be asked to specify the SharePoint site where the integration will be enabled. Choose the SharePoint site URL you want to integrate with Dynamics 365. Copy the selected URL from your SharePoint site. Paste the URL in the provided box and click Next. Finalize your SharePoint integration configuration by reviewing the information and click Finish once the SharePoint site is found to be valid. At this point, the Document option will become visible on entities in Dynamics 365. Now we need to choose which entities we want to enable SharePoint integration. To enable document management for specific entities, enter the SharePoint site URL where the document library will reside. Make sure to select the entities you want to enable document management and click next to proceed. You'll be prompted to confirm the creation of the document locations for the selected entities. Simply click OK to proceed. The selected entities will now be processed and enable document management. Wait for a few moments until the process is completed. Once the process is finished, the error in the accounts document section will disappear. You'll notice that the documents grid is ready for uploading documents. Even if you don't upload anything, the folder structure will be created in SharePoint when you navigate or open the grid on the Dynamics 365 record. As an example, let's upload a sample document to the record. The document will appear in the Documents tab within Dynamics 365 and in the SharePoint library. Congratulations, we have successfully enabled SharePoint Online integration with Dynamics 365 CRM. Now you can seamlessly manage and collaborate on documents within your Dynamics 365 environment. Thank you for watching this video and we hope it was helpful. Don't forget to like, subscribe and leave any questions or comments below.